Audi is getting serious about its portfolio of battery electric models and is set to launch three battery electric vehicles over the next three years, CEO Rupert Stadler officially confirmed at the 2017 Vienna Motor Symposium. There will be two mid-size crossover models and a more compact premium car. The push to go full electric seems to have put plans to offer a plug-in hybrid model of the Q7 SUV in the US on the back burner, as we reported earlier this year. Here are Audi's definite future plans for its fully electric e-tron models, in chronological order, Audi e-tron Quattro, previewed by the e-tron Quattro concept, above, displayed at the 2015 Frankfurt Auto Show, this crossover will feature a spacious interior a futuristic cockpit, and high-performance powertrains beginning at more than 300 horsepower. The top model will deliver about 430 horsepower, including a short-term peak of around 500 horsepower. Maximum torque should be around 590 pounds to foot this model will have one electric motor up front and two in the rear, and the top model will be able to reach 60 miles per hour in about 4.5 seconds with a governed top speed of 130 miles per hour based on Audi's modular longitudinal MLB platform and with a footprint similar to that of an A6 but taller, it will come to market in late 2018 as a 2019 model. The Bass model is likely to be priced starting at around $60,000. Dynamic Photo, Color, Lux Silver Audi e-tron Quattro Sport Back, if you've seen the Shanghai Auto Show concept. Above, you have seen a good 80% of the final model. This is the sportback version of the above described Z-Tron Quattro, and the concept's looks are extremely close to those of the series production model. This includes the futuristic horizontal taillight stretching across the entire width of the vehicle. But it also includes the tiny camera rear-view mirrors, which project the view onto old screens. Where legal, they will be offered. Other markets get conventional mirrors. The interior will be cleverly differentiated from the e-tron Quattro, much as the Audi A7s differs from that in the A6. We expect to see the same three-motor powertrain that is fitted in the e-tron Quattro, with peak power of around 500 horsepower for the top-of-the-line model. Pricing of the Sportback will be slightly above that of the regular model, carrying a premium of about $5,000. It will appear on global markets in 2019 and be sold in